they're stable. Willing and able. Where are we going, Randall? <laughs> uh, on the Parker D with Captain go. Donley today. It's a big jump, Miles. Miles, you just slide through the hole if you want to. <laughs> Like sliding in the DMs. That is big shrimp in part two. <laughs> big shrimp in part two. Big that is correct. This is uh, starting a lot earlier. This is a whole nother. That's, that's a, big a build, build pump right there, Jay. Sorry, we're late. <laughs> we're in early. <laughs> we're going big shrimp in part two today in South Carolina. How are you going? I'm Nick. Yeah, man, I know who you are. All right, <laughs> I know that's your part. What's your name? I'm Don? David. David, I'm perfect. What's your name, buddy? Don. Tony, good to meet you. So we're riding out on the commercial uh, shrimp boat today. Thanks for having us. Good morning. Oh, look. Yes. Today's your birthday? Today is my birthday. Happy birthday, Randy. Uh, you ready for us? Yes. <laughs> What's your name, buddy? Can you tell me what the plan is today? Besides catch lots of shrimp? We're just going to drive big nets, right? You guys are in for something different today, us as well. It is early, but we are headed out there shrimping. Set. We're just trying to stay out of the way. Some 20 more 
minutes we put the nets in the shrimp. They're ready now though. Birds are ready. Oh, you can feel that wind now. They don't come untied. <laughs> don't do a knot, tie a lot. Yeah, it's 2.0 for sure. Look at that. I've never seen that before. <laughs> hey, we could be throwing the cast at. No, sir. Too cold for that. It's a little breezy, cold for that little breezy in South Carolina this morning. Too cold for that. Northeast winds, no fun. <laughs> no fun whatsoever. job on here if you do good today. If Miles performs well today, this is like his test run. Maybe he gets a job out of shrimping. The birds! The birds are following us! It's your shooting that makes it boring. Man. I need to practice. You need a lot of practice. Can you give us a quick rundown? We're doing. We set the nets. We're gonna. You said pull for three hours and check them. Mm-hmm. Yep. What's the name of the boat? Uh, Parker D. Parker D. Parker D. Yeah. How long have you been trimming for? Uh, my whole life. Uh, but I've had my own boat since '94. Yeah, '94. I've had my own boat. '94. So that's uh, 20. Is that 28 years? Is that right? Well, six plus two. <laughs> It's early. 28? 28. Do you think we're going to force gum them today or do you think it's going to be tough? It's going to be tough. <laughs> okay. It's, uh, like we didn't work, it dropped off so bad, but we got a weather change, so you know, that's why I didn't mind coming to try. Might be in our favor. Yeah, with the weather, a little bit of a weather change. So basically the big planer boards, they, they go down and then pull everything out? Yep, that's, that's 
doors they'll go down they'll spread and then you have the sled in the middle because we pull two nets on each side and, and it takes and opens them up so you got four nets total mm -hmm. four okay nets, yeah. <clears throat> and how wide is that open uh it'll be you know you don't get your full spread so you look at it probably 60 or so foot of spread or whatever okay. you know how many shrimp do we need to break even today um well, well, we're just gonna make a couple short drags, so 167 pounds. Okay. Of tails. What okay. is a, a 48 quart like in, in normal shrimp and roll? We're throwing the cast nets. A 48 quart. Well, how much is that way? Just to give tails would be 50 pounds. You can get 50 yeah. pounds in a. In a 48 minute, it's like a 48 quart. The limit with heads is 48 quart. So, what does that equate to in tails? Uh, what would that be? Somewhere around 30. See, like those baskets back there if you got a level basket mm -hmm. you can kind of count on 75 pound of tails okay but a level basket of head on is only going to be about 65 pound you know, okay. head on okay. all right do you tails pop the heads out here or when you get back to the dock yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. miles that might be your job today there's a lot of sugar <laughs> yeah how long do you check the try net uh to start with 15 to 20 minutes and then it's more and more boring. We get a third minute. Drive. <laughs> 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 uh, if you're all shore working, you'll you'll try that pretty much 15 because the streaks, you know, you got to try and start. So how deep or how is the net touching the bottom? Oh yeah, yeah, it's it's the bottom. Like yeah you want it to get down to the bottom, and then it's gonna have a tickling chain in front that bumps the bottom and it kicks them up, bump them, and yeah, they'll hop up. You got a tickler chain. How often do you like run into wrecks and stuff? No, I try not. That's what all these different marks are. Okay. Wrecks and all that. Stay, stay, yeah. stay away from. Yeah. You have to stay away from. The whole boat stops. That's a terrible feeling. Oh yeah, it's it like, is. Ah, oh yeah, you're stuck. Design. That's when you mash the panic button. <laughs> you're running around. Um, but I tell you, I've caught some old schooner anchors and stuff. Really? They date back to 1700s and all on the shore. Wow. That's uh, cool. Caught one on bull shore, one on cape shore. I got one in the front yard and I gave my sister another one. But yeah, those are pretty neat. Cool. Yeah. Can we catch one of those tonight? Here. Catch an anchor. Take it home with you on the airplane. Yeah. Tomorrow morning. Yeah, you can throw it in the freedom and, and bring it to the boat show. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we're going to check the tri net, it sounds like, first, and then in a few hours, pull the big nets. Oh, a little bit of luck, got some shrimp in there. It's a shrimp cocktail. That's a big shrimp. Look at it's a shrimp cocktail. I feel like Forrest Gump when he got his first shrimp. We got one. What kind of fish is that? That? Yeah. Hog choker, is that what they call it? Yeah. Never heard of it. Was that right? Woman, yeah, that's what they said. Oh, Scott, the guy from the Florida Keys. Hey, I catch right. bigger stuff than that. Alright. <laughs> it's a mini flounder. We're checking the tri net again. Pull number two on it. 15. 15 shrimp the first time. Hope it'll be more this time. Every 15 minutes we're pulling it for now. They said maybe later on we'll go to 30 minutes, but lots of birds following us. There's some porpoise back there behind us.
nice ones, huh? There you go. Well, we got two shrimp cocktails now. There we go. Just <laughs> a few more to go. Are we shrimping in style? This is shrimping on a whole nother level. I can get used to this. Are we not on the bay boat throwing no. the nets now, huh? No, Making bay no, balls. No bay no, balls. No bay balls. No bay yeah, balls no bay needed balls. here. This is uh Miles just fell down. No, it was Scott, it was big Miles. <laughs> there, there's a, there's a, there's a, we'll go and check it again. Yep, y'all have fun. Kind of, I, I got the seat right this here. This is my kind of shrimp. There yes. you go. Well, I'll go check the net this time.
<laughs> we're cooling out. Cooling out. We go home now. How's that for full? Pretty decent. Yeah. Good. Good. Hey, the birds are stealing my shrimp. Oh yeah. Get out of here, birds! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, birds, yeah! They're stealing a the shrimp. <laughs> oh, that's a big one. Yeah, birds, yeah! Miles are stealing the shrimp. Get him out of there. Yeah, yeah! They said it's a good pull. We got shrimp now. Let's go stingray. Let him go, Scott. Let him go. <laughs> you just tell us to get out of your way, all right, boss? You are, man. All right. Yeah, you got your back off there. The birds. What's that? Oh, Spanish? Or King? Something, huh? So they're de-heading them right now, taking the heads off and uh, put them in the uh, crates there. Are you going by size too? Just the size, we're keeping them 21s. 21, 25 is what we're looking for. And that was that 21, 25 shrimp per pound? Yep, 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 21, 21 to 25 shrimp per pound. Okay, so they're doing it by size. They're taking the heads up. They want 21, 25. That means it's 21, 25 shrimp per pound. They got a couple different baskets. They got a basket up there, the bigger ones, the smaller and medium ones down there. Oh, I just got pooped on again. 
That's twice I've been pooped on by a bird. This is where all your shrimp come from. You guys eat shrimp, especially up here. This ain't big shrimp in part two, guys. This is extra large shrimp. In. This is like 10.0. We'd have cooled out like maybe five <laughs> or six times going home. Oh, yeah. So we're still working on dehydrating all these shrimp. We're going to put them in the tri net here to see how this area is. This will be a while. There's a little ray in there. Look at that thing. That's weird looking, huh? I know. It's a cool looking crab. That's a nice right? You were heading him as you went? Yeah. Oh, that's quick. He was picking that pinch in the head up as he picked him up there. Look at that, that was pretty quick. Hey, you're doing good. I know, I'm doing good. You're getting better, getting quicker. Miles, how you doing, buddy? Doing good. You getting him? Alrighty. Are you de-heading him too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're a lot bigger than our shrimp. Like that one, which isn't that a very big one. Dude, that is a big shrimp there. Holy moly. Look at that thing there. Dude, that is a big shrimp. Oh my god. Dude, that is insane. That's crazy. These guys are smoking us. Their baskets are full. Ours are about not even a quarter. But everyone's getting faster, we'll say that. Sarah, Kate, Miles. But anyhow, just popping the heads off. And you're supposed to be doing it by size. But uh we're not, we're not that good yet, so we're just gonna pop their heads up and then uh resize them after that. We'll see. And then probably about two hours, two and a half hours we're gonna pull the nets again, but basically just popping the heads up. I'm trying to watch these guys see how they do it. But if you can get it in one shot there, you can do it fairly quick. A couple different ways to do it, but when you get this many of it, you wanna be quick on it, so if you can do it like that I guess. I got a long way to go though, but I'm learning. Some of these shrimps are huge. I mean, that's a really nice shrimp right there. Unbelievable to see this. I always want to see this. I feel like we're on the Gen A with Boris Go. I like to see Captain Dan up there. Captain Dan. So we're slowly catching up. No, we're not. Oh, Miles. You got pooped on, buddy. A bird pooped on the back of your thing here. We're not really catching up to them, but we're making progress. And we're getting better ourselves, so. But check this out. Is that your second basket? Sully, was that your second basket already? He's faster? Well, I tell you what, you're all a lot faster than us. You're doing more than us, five of us combined. This is like 70 pounds of shrimp. Look at those shrimp, holy moly. This is big shrimp, baby. So these are the smaller ones, these are the bigger ones. How's that feel, good? Heavy. That's a big basket of shrimp. Kate, you're getting faster too. I know, we're filling up. There you go. I know. Miles is playing with jelly balls, trying to hit the birds. You think you'd be faster if we just stopped doing what we're doing up there? No. We're not slowing you down too much? Not at all. That's because we're at least we're up there away from you. Good, man. If we were back here, we'd be in your way probably. That's right. And you said these things live a long time, huh? Yes, these things can live out of the water for hours and hours, all overnight, they said. Yeah. Watch how fast these heads get pinched up. As he picks them up, he pinches the heads up. And he's got it down to a science. Both these guys do. Are you listening to music now? What are you listening to? What I can still hear you. Yeah, who are you listening to? Three Doors Down. Three Doors Down? He said he listening to Three Doors Down, that helps with the shrimp popping. Yes, if I could be like that, I'd right. give you everything. Right. My superhuman group yeah. tonight. Almost right. done, huh? I feel like we helped at least. We did help. I mean, between that one and that one, it's almost a full basket. Yeah. We didn't we didn't sort them, but. And that 
fast girth there weighs almost 75 pounds. He said 70 to 75 pounds right here full of shrimp. And then these are the smaller ones down there. There's a more bass girth over here too. Look at that one there, another one over here. So they did all that by themselves, you know, they used to basket, basket and a quarter, I would say. We got to do one full basket between like four of us. So, yeah, we're doing a lot faster than us. Okay, that's perfect. What's the biggest shrimp you caught? I think they were 11 coat. 11 coat? Wow. It's like two years ago. We all throw something that kind of lamb.
there, Bird. Yeah. Oh, he's out of our trip, Nick. I know. What the heck, Bird? Bye bye, buddy. Oof. Are we throwing them this time? Yeah. Look at these shrimp, guys. Big old shrimp, baby. Don't bother. Big shrimping. That right there is a big shrimp, folks. You can eat good. Oh, that one there might even be bigger. Oh, yeah. Yeah, don't mess it up this time. You're getting fired on your first day. Hey, birds, back off. The birds are trying to fly with their shrimp. <laughs> oh, now we're talking right there. Oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. That's there. Pop the head off. <laughs> Come on, Randall. Is that a good pull? Yeah. Decent? Yeah, pretty. Average. What do you think, Randy? It's pretty cool. Different pretty cool to see? It's definitely a different experience today. You've never done this before, right? Nope. First time doing this one. You, you get to see what, that, what it's all about, you know? That's right. This has been a part of the low country for, I couldn't tell you how many years. Oh, yeah. A lot of work. You, ain't, you got that right. You ain't kidding. Way more work than sword fishing. Four steam mackerel today to have a worm. Look at that thing. Uh, that's, a, that, that's, what, that's the elusive king mackerel. Bye bye, buddy. Be free. Miles, do you think you got being a shrimper in your future career, maybe? Maybe. <laughs> Well, you're doing decent now. Sorry. You guys are doing a lot faster. Sir, what do you think? Pretty cool? Well, like thousands of trucks. Thousands. Yeah. You didn't get to go last totally. time. No, y'all went without me. There wasn't room for me. The guys are going to dehead all these shrimp. We're going to help them a little bit. And we're heading back to the dock. So a little bit of an earlier day. They would have kept fishing, but uh, they kind of want to take it out here as well. So we appreciate that. And a big thank you to everyone on board, especially Kat. We'll, uh, See you guys on the way there. Which one of you birds pooped on me? Almost back in. So we're coming back in the inlet here. You guys are making quick work back here. That basket there's 80% full. There's a smaller shrimp down here. So we're getting a little better up here. I mean, we got a long way to go to you guys, but five or they six. Got, they got smaller baskets. It don't count. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Uh-huh. Five or six of us is doing about half of what one of you guys do, so. <laughs> Look at you go. So they're looking at the shrimp and you know, they're keeping the head facing ways so they can pop them up there. And they happen so fast and they move them around. I mean, there's an art to it. How many shrimp are we gonna get in your hands? About 10 total, you think? Five and five? 12. 12? 12, You got big hands, huh? Mm-hmm. Got to have big hands, that's the key. There's some discard, some bycatch, but that's just part of shrimping. The birds love it though. You can hear the birds going crazy. A pogey. Is that a pogey? Yeah, a pogey. That's a manish shrimp right here, guys. They're bad news and dangerous. You gotta be careful with these things. They can smack you and hurt you. Clean up crew, Randy? You know it. Somebody got to be good at something. Oh, oh he's steaming up. There he's bumping That's her it. up, guys. That's it. There you go. He's blowing out the motor there. What do you think top speed is on here? Like seven? Uh, uh, no. We're home now. Yeah, we're going home yeah, now. We're going home now. Whenever they go to clean the net, you might want to come up because they'll be slinging jelly everywhere. <laughs> no, tell Randy to stay back there. <laughs> Scott, stay in the back when they clean the nets. This is really cool. He said when he cleans the nets, stay back there. <laughs>
chains tickle the ticklers, right? Tickler so it hits the bottom and gets the shrimp jumping? That's it. It bumps, it bumps the bottom and keeps the shrimp jumping up. Right. And the nets right there to kick. You got to use them, huh? That's it. Got For the best? Have, got to have them. Now, if one of us want to get a job on here, who's got the best shot? Who, who worked the best out of us? The little guy? Where's Miles at? Miles, where's the little fella at? Miles, where he hide from us. He's the one, though, right? So it sounds like Miles would be the yeah. best candidate if uh, one of us is going to get a job on here. Sir, are these chairs more comfortable than mine? Yes. That's a nice chair. Hey, thank you for taking us out here. Oh, you're welcome. Glad you came. It was fun. Cool to see. A unique experience. He drives the boat like how I drive it. My foot. Yeah. My foot driving. How many pounds do you think we got? A couple hundred or not? Oh yeah. Well, we had a. Uh, I think we said it was 160 on the first one, and then I don't even know what what it is on which one we had. Right. Uh, it should be close to the same. One, I think. Okay. Good. Well, y'all think it's more than an eagle right there? I would have thought the uh, an eagle. Yep. See him sitting on that marker. Oh yeah. There's an eagle over there. Look, there's an eagle over here, guys. There's a bald eagle, guys, right there. So, uh, you've been doing it for how long? 15 years? About 15 years, yeah. What's, What's the it? best day ever? The best day ever? The best day ever is when we get to offload and then about an hour later, I'm going to get a text and I look at my phone and David's going to say, your text ready. <laughs> your text ready. Payday, baby. <laughs> What's the most pounds I'll ever caught? <laughs> yeah. What's the most pounds in a day? In a day? Yeah. We had a couple 40 basket drags, so you're talking maybe 26, 2700 pounds for the drag? Yeah. Wow. That's for the drag, just like, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so, you know, we're liable to get out here tomorrow, and it's here, you know, you never know. Big shrimping. Big shrimping, baby. <laughs> Big shrimping. If you like what you saw so far in this video, drop a thumbs up. We had a ball with these guys. It's pretty fun. We want to try to get more views on the other shrimp video, so thank you guys for watching that one. Big shrimp in part two needs more views. We got this. We got this. Especially since we Joe got didn't more show shrimp. Up. Joe doesn't even show up. Yeah. I mean, come on. And you got girls this yeah, time. And we got right. girls here. Yeah. We got, girls yeah. We we got, got plenty more then. And Miles was here too. Miles. And what? Scott. Yeah, you weren't even there last I time, weren't. were you? I, I was entertaining. I was trying to. Right. I got a deer hunt. You know, we had to kind of pull it together last minute this year. At least you killed one. That's right. We got a. Somebody did. Got a lot of deer. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We're sleeping right now. How are you? Hey, how are y'all? Great. Good. We had an awesome adventure. Awesome. I'm David's wife. Good to meet you. Good to meet you. It was a fun day. Uh, got a gallon of water? Yeah, I'll take some water. It was beautiful. Thank you guys so much for taking us along with you too. Oh, I really awesome. appreciate it. Appreciate so. it. Okay. All right, what else? That's we eating good tonight. <laughs> Are you videoing that? So that wraps up the shrimp and expedition. We're gonna see you guys back at the house here cooking tonight. We're having a big shrimp feast and you can get these fresh shrimp here from Carolina Seafood Retail Market and it's right up here. So if you guys are ever down here in McClellanville, I don't know if I'm saying 100% right, but if you're down in the area, you guys want to eat some of these fresh shrimp off these boats here, come check it out there. Carolina Seafood Retail Market right there. They got all sorts of stuff in there. Fish, clam, shrimp, crab, you name it, they got it. Scallops.
You guys see that? We're about to have shrimp burgers. Paul couldn't be here with us tonight, but we hope you're having fun at our bachelor party. But anyhow, Stephen just whipped up some shrimp burgers. I'm gonna let him kind of tell you what's in them. Then we got 10 patties made here. We uh, pulled all the shells off the shrimp there in the back of Scott's truck, and there's a lot of shrimp in that cooler. Now, what all was in the shrimp burgers there, Stephen? Uh, we got pureed shrimp, and then we also have to chop some just to give it a little more texture. Right. And then it's breadcrumbs, Parmesan cheese, uh, a little bit of spices like Old Bay, uh, smoked paprika. There was egg in there too, right? And two there eggs. was two eggs. Two eggs in the batch. So it's about, what do you say, three pounds of shrimp? Four pounds of shrimp? Probably three or four in. pounds, yeah. yeah. This is gonna be yummy. A couple of them have jalapenos. We're gonna try to burn Scott's mouth. <laughs> Yeah, you can see the green jalapenos in a couple of them there. What do you think of the experience today? Pretty cool? Pretty cool. I've lived, I've lived in the Carolinas for a long time and seen many a shrimp boats on the water. I've never been on one. That was really cool to see how, how it all worked. Wasabi was hot. The wasabi was hot? It was hot. What did you eat, the Wahoo? Yes. It was a little warm on the day. Hey, it's Randy's months. birthday. Yeah, Randy, happy birthday. Thank you, thank you. Arnie McCabe, we're sending you a hat. Good to meet you there. Hopefully we'll see you down in the Keys one day if you ever make it there. The shrimp burgers are done. And they look and smell really good, you guys. Bubba Gump would be proud. <laughs> Brought to you by the Parker D. Yeah. Thank you, Parker D, for taking us out there for the experience. Those look really good there, you guys. We got some venison backstrap on the Traeger over here, too. Check that out. We're going to have ourselves a feast tonight. Miles, how's the burger? Pretty good. Pretty good or really good? Really good. I will be happy. What do you think of the burger, Kate? I love it. I think Something it might different? be his best one yet. Oh. Yeah, pretty good. Steven's pretty well known for making trip burgers lately. Yeah, he has uh he stepped his game out. That's for Look sure. at you got jambalaya, you got jambalaya, crawfish pie, meal ma. You got a little shrimp burger there. Everybody's happy. Not a bad Saturday, huh? The fresh uh -huh. shrimp make all the difference. They do, don't they? Yeah. There's some pretty shrimp out there, too. Oh, very nice. What do you think? Good stuff, Randy? Good stuff. Really good stuff. Pretty good. You approve? Yeah. Thumbs up? Perfect. The back strap's almost done. We got shrimp burgers. Everyone's inside eating them. They got the music going, though. So I stepped outside here to talk to you guys and tell you what I thought of it. It looks really good. The last one I had was up here a year ago that Paul made. That was pretty good, too. We got one more tonight. Try. Kind of like Sarah said, tastes like a burger but with shrimp. Really good, something different to do. We got a bunch of boiled shrimp. We got backstrap, we got Wahoo appetizer. And uh, we had a pretty good trip out here. So it was pretty cool and pretty fun. Really enjoy it. something different, you know, something unique. So we really appreciate them taking us on the Parker D. And hopefully we get to do it again one day. I'm gonna go back inside you guys and hang out with everyone. But I hope you enjoyed that video. Hit that like button, make sure to subscribe. If you want any merch, head to the website, stansfishing.com. That wraps it up. But we'll see y'all next time and uh, stay tuned. We got more videos coming your way. They ain't gonna make it, are they? They're not gonna make the cut.